Thank you, Creator Source Love, for bringing Aries a message today, something for their highest good, to bring them inspiration or information, maybe some clarification on their situation, to bring them to their highest possible timeline, the most love and happiness possible. You get one of these, okay. Judgment in the upright. then Aries oh wow I turned right to the page did you see that judgment change of position renewal outcome another account specifies total loss through lawsuit Let's see what comes out to support that the science of mind deck for Aries. Thank you, Creator Source Love, for allowing my voice to bring healing to everyone who hears it. Even if the message isn't what they were hoping for, it is what they needed at the time. Right now. Yeah. Greater source love for bringing a message for Aries from this deck of cards today. Right now. Whenever this finds them. Come on now. To you. Ideas matter. Things are ideas in form. What else could they be? There is nothing from which to make things except ideas. Grow. Let us be happy to begin right where we are and grow. The mind within does the real seeing, the real interpreting of what the eyes look upon. Ooh. Mm. Beauty is in the eye of the beholder and all that jazz. Okay, let's get a goddess card for Aries. Demeter. Ah. Demeter is an ancient Greek great mother goddess, a goddess of life and death. The Greeks emphasized her role as goddess of the, of the cultivated earth, the giver of fruitfulness and abundance, and provider of the gift of agriculture. She and her daughter Persephone, called by the Greeks the goddesses, together represent the continuous cycle of life and death, the two phases of the vegetative power of the earth. Demeter is remembered primarily for her great love for her daughter, when Persephone was abducted by Hades, Demeter's grief caused the whole earth to go barren. Here we see Demeter get ready to give birth, to produce life. Demeter offers a blessing of fruitfulness and possibility of coming joy, of abundant life and hope. And then we got Etain. Etain, whose name literally means Shining One, was a Celtic moon goddess, the second wife of Medir, king of the underworld. Medir's first wife, Fawn Mok, was jealous of Etain and turned her into a fly. Falling into a glass of wine, Etain drowned. She was reborn and married Eakade, a fertility god. Medir challenged Eakade to a game of chess. The result was that Etain must spend half her year underground and half on earth. Etain is a, especially a symbol of fertility, of the vitality and life of all growing things. A goddess familiar with both life and death, she teaches that wherever we are, on earth or in the depths of the underworld, we too can be shining. Wow. Romance Angel Oracle next for Aries. Thank you, Creator Source Love.
you guys, I'm going to ask you to not post the same question over and over in the comments when you can clearly see that I am doing the signs right now. All right, Romance Angels for Aries. Let's see. Ooh, okay. You have to release your ex too. The time has come to clear your energy. You got some goodies. Oh, there was some deception. Someone was wearing a false self mask in that relationship. You got to let it go. Let it go, Aries. Let it go. Because you have a soulmate coming in. It says you've already met them. You've already met the romantic partner you seek, Mr. Soulmate. This deck for Aries. What else? That was crooked. That was bad. Very tricky. Anything else? Yee! Ha! The mask came out again. Isn't that funny? So, someone's pretending, deluding, gaslighting, hiding, not showing true feelings is confirmed. Um, releasing your ex, the Grim Reaper. This relationship is over. No second chances. Grow and transform your life. And then coffee cup. You'll meet someone new, conversing, savoring the moment. Now let go of the old and welcome in the new, 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 new. All right, let's see what song we can get for Aries. One message from the angels for the Aries Collective. Mercy. All right, let's see what you got, Aries. Mercy. Fall. The works. And then, oh, you got three. Panini, Lil Nas X. And then, what's my age again? Blink 182. On side B, Melissa, Allman Brothers. Up Funk, Pigeons Playing Ping Pong. Burning Up My Time, Pigeons Playing Ping Pong. Oh, wow. All right, there. 